Hello and welcome to my let's play of Hades. Hades is a game developed by Supergiant Games, the same studio that has also developed Bastion, Transistor and Pyre. So quite a few really amazing games coming out of that studio and uh, yeah, so I'm really excited to try this one. As you can see, uh, Hades is still in early access and as you can also see in the lower right corner, uh, the next release is gonna be the version 1.0 launch release. But there's no, um, no date given, given yet for it to be released. Uh, we only know that it will be later this year. But, well, I mean, until then, we can check out this early access. Hades is a 3D action roguelite dungeon crawler, which means there might be some similarities to Curse of the Dead Gods. But I guess that's for us to find out. And there's only one way to do this. Let's play. Okay, uh, yeah, I've uh, played just a little bit before to try if everything is running properly, but we can uh, can delete this save slot and start a new game here. We are not gonna play in hell mode right now. We are just gonna start a regular game. So here we go. Few tales are told of Hades whose very name inspires fear and penitence, reminding us of the inevitable fate which we all share. I, however, mean to tell you such a tale. Listen carefully. All right. Goodbye, Father. Hmm. This is looking rather interesting. <laughs> um... Yes, you can tell there seems to be some some Greek mythology theme to be going on. <laughs> and this might be Zeus. I don't know. Guess we'll find out. And we can <laughs> make these ghosts disappear. And we can slice a regular attack. We can do a big attack. And we can throw this thingy. So I've, as I've said, <clears throat> tried the basics of this game, but not much more. I can also roll around, um, but I haven't reset the settings on the safe and I will do that to make it uh, a bit more like um, Curse of the Dead Gods, so I don't uh, unlearn everything that I've learned for Curse of the Dead Gods. So I want to be dashing slash dodging on the right trigger button and we can smash a lot of stuff. So that's nice. Fix that for you. <laughs> I like the commentary. <laughs> Okay, well, let's proceed and not waste any more time. It's fun to smash stuff, but it's even more fun to smash enemies. That went well. Ah, damn. Got hit there. That was not necessary. But hey, first run, it's okay. Okay, whoa. Projectile coming our way. There she is. There she is. Okay. It's got to be her. Then here goes nothing. <clears throat> In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hail, noble cousin. Now, let's get you from that miserable place. I'll see that all of us upon Olympus do our part, beginning here with me. Okay, we get a bit of story here. Um, okay. 
Divine Strike, your attack is stronger and can deflect attack damage plus 40%. Phalanx Shot, your cast damages foes in a small area and can deflect. Divine Dash, your dash deals damage and can deflect. I think I would like my dash, which is kind of also my dodge, to be deflecting as well, because then we kind of have all the evasion in one thing. I'm not so sure about the phalanx shot yet, so yeah, let's just um, select the divine dash. I know you can't hear me all the way where you are, goddess, but thank you. Okay. Looked like she was right there, but okay. <laughs> let's proceed. <laughs> Fight me. Um, Interesting, interesting thing to say while smashing pots. So one thing that obviously is different from Darkest, uh, Darkest Dungeon. I always say Darkest Dungeon for some reason when I want to talk about um, Curse of the Dead Gods. Don't know why that is. <laughs> Damn. Ah, stood in the trap area there. That's not good. Well, I think we got a key. I where I can use this. Yep, I do. Um, Can't heal myself, but I can fight. Okay, that's good. <laughs> uh, yeah, one obvious uh, difference is that there is, uh, as we can see, quite a bit of dialogue here, uh, which is at least so far still lacking in Curse of the Dead Gods. So that's interesting. I like some story in my games. Even if it's not Centaur Heart. Okay. Max life plus 25. Well, that's really useful right now. Um, yeah, I guess we proceed. So, but other things are quite resemblant of um, Curse of the Dead Gods, like these traps, for example. <laughs> um, but, I mean, it's not a bad thing that these games resemble each other. I think they will have unique features, uh, like enough of unique features as well. Okay. We gained some darkness, I assume. <laughs> uh, that's nice, I think. <laughs> Let's proceed. Damn, something got me there. Not sure what exactly hit me. And this is, ah, damn, sometimes really crowded. And really fast paced and a lot of movement because I mean there's no no separate parry button you can only do the dash and like deflect uh, thingies like I do it with my dodge since I cho chose that in the beginning uh, so yeah a lot of movement going on and uh, things get crowded, so I guess let's proceed once more. <laughs> okay, I think I timed these attacks and dashes well. Because I saw some deflect notifiers there. And I think I didn't lose any more health than I did before, so that's good. But yeah, this is really fast paced. <laughs> so that will take some getting used to. Okay, another one. I can use that back home, okay. Wherever home is. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. Let's continue. Damn, these seem like elite enemies somehow and some of them hit me. Okay. That sound. Mm-hmm. That was revelry. Revelry. Good time. Well sure then. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I'll accept this message. Seems like that's the magic phrase. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I'll accept this message. Okay, so that's why he said um, you can't hear me because it's just a, a relayed message, but not really a direct dialogue. Okay. Hey there, Zag man. How's it going? Look, you've got to get here with the rest of us already. We've been saving you a spot. Let me see what I can do. Make life a little sweeter for you in the meantime. Okay. So Dionysus says uh, we need to get with them. So I assume they are in Olympus and I am in Hades and I want to get up there. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see what I can do. Make life a little sweeter for you in the meantime. What do we get? Drunken strike. Your attacks in uh, your attack inflicts hangover. Okay. Hangover, status curse for four seconds. Victim keeps taking damage. Effect can stack up to five times. Interesting. Drunken flourish. Your special inflicts hangover. So basically the Y attack. I haven't used that yet. Uh, not not in practice. Like uh, only first when I tested everything. Premium vintage. Gain max life when you pick up nectar i guess receive one nectar now uh i'd like our attacks to deal more damage but i think for now we might need more health so let's take the premium vintage leave it to the god of wine to liven things up around here ah, there it is too? hmm well interesting we got some nectar as well so that's pretty cool Wonder what that does. Uh -oh. Okay, more elite enemies. Seems like a mini boss fight or something like that. These definitely are different enemies than the ones we've seen before. So, a lot of bombs being dropped here. But that's all right for now. I mean, oh damn, that was mean. Damn, that... That attack where they leave the bombs and then jump away, that's really horrible. Okay. At least I dodged the last one, I think. But this hurt. There's only one heavenly archer I know of. Well, several, really. Anyway, in the name of Hades, Olympus, <laughs> I accept this message. <laughs> okay. I heard about you. Look, I'm not like all the others on Olympus. The power of the hunt helps keep me company, so maybe it'll help you too. Okay. I like the depiction of the gods in this game. <laughs> okay, Deadly Strike, your attack is stronger with plus 15% to deal critical damage and it seems to be an epic thingy to get. Let's still look at the others. This boosts our special and is only rare. True Shot, your cast seeks foes with 10% chance to deal critical damage. I guess I just select the attack that I am using all the time, although I should probably use my ranged attack sometimes too. <laughs> hey Banger, nice of you to join. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm checking out this game and so far it's really cool, really fast paced combat and um, a lot of fun so far. 
right now I'm selecting an upgrade. Um, my health is a bit low, but I can't really do anything about that right now. And that's kind of where we are. <laughs> I think I'll pick the deadly strike since it will boost our attack and I'm always using this attack. So I guess here we go. Also, it's the epic choice. So yeah, seems nice. They sure could use some company now that she mentions it. The power of the hunt sounds handy too. Okay, press select, I guess, for boon info. Divine dash, yeah, okay, we can see here what we got. So that's neat. All right, we can unlock quite a few things if you, uh, if you take a look at all these grayed out um, spots. So yeah, that's, that's nice. <laughs> Let's continue to the next room. Okay, more enemies and not much room. Damn, I think, yeah, they got me there. But I dealt some epic damage there, like more than 80. Haven't done that before. That's pretty nice. But I'm almost dead. That's not so nice. <laughs> Deflecting those bullets is a lot of fun. <laughs> Ah, oh, damn, walking into traps is not, and getting hit isn't either. Well, that was bloody. <laughs> huh, guess we died. That's not epic. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> okay, that's anticlimactic, but we're home in the house of Hades. <laughs> Okay. No way. Okay, I can't attack here. Who are you? Welcome to the House of Hades where wait, I know you. Guess that means you died out there, huh? Don't be sad though, pretty much everybody dies sometime. Okay. That's helpful. <laughs> Some of us more than others. Okay. I guess it's not Zeus then, but Hades <laughs> has uh, also kind of a Zeus flair about him. What's in... before I talk to Hades, what's up with you, the other areas? Remember your training out there. The pain of death is but another obstacle. Okay. And fear is for the weak. Take care, Achilles. I really like the depiction of the characters, like those uh, mythological characters. But yeah, I've said that before. What's going on the here? House of Hades, that dark and lavishly appointed layer of the underworld's king, is home not just to him, but to his willful progeny. Okay. You know I can hear you, old man. <laughs> Did he actually say that out loud? <laughs> um, okay. You have come home. Seems so. Do not despair, child. Such setbacks are inevitable and may be overcome with effort and with time. Though, tell me, has the goddess Athena thus been true to her word? I'm not sure what's been her word. She has, Nyx. I'm grateful that you put us into contact and explained to her the situation that I'm in. I know you took a considerable risk in reaching out. Yeah, okay, I think it was the first power-up that we got. It was from Athena. It was the least that I could do. The Olympians shall make powerful allies, but reveal to them no more than they already know, for all our sakes. Okay. Also, really nice artwork. <laughs> Well, this is a friend and we found some nectar, so we might give it to her, but maybe not now. Let's first check out what else is going on here. Oh, we can pet Cerberus, is it? <laughs> um, I guess let's do that then. Why wouldn't you pet a three-headed hound of hell? There's a good boy. <laughs> Just 
Aww. That's great. Every game should implement a feature to pet all the animals you come uh, come across. <laughs> Let's talk to Cerberus, or will we talk to Hades then? Infernal watchdog Cerberus regards the underworld prince with mixed emotions, from purest joy to deepest melancholy. That voiceover sounds, maybe that's why I'm thinking of Darkest Dungeon, sounds a lot like the narrator in Darkest Dungeon to me. But I'm not sure. <laughs> you watch over things for me, won't you, boy? You know I'd take you if I could. Hmm. Yeah, let's let's take Cerberus with us. It will make things easier. <laughs> well, let's talk to Hades Stupid then. Boy. I told you nobody gets out of here, whether alive or dead. So how was your wanton ransacking of my domain? Quite well, thanks for asking. Greetings, father. My ransacking was a delight, oh. thank you for asking. So I'll just be on my way again. Did it say before that we were the prince of the underworld or was that just added? <laughs> because this is news to me, maybe I just didn't notice before, but... All right. That ransacking was a delight, <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. So I'll be on my way again. Okay. Be on your way indeed. What do I care? You shall never reach the surface. Go, see for yourself. Okay. I like um, how they set up this uh, these these roguelite elements that you basically start over and over again. And I also like how Hades is basically just filling out forms here. It's it's really cool how they've interpreted. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you wish. What the hell is this? Um, the vast and intricately crafted mosaic depicts the underworld king presiding over the enormity of his domain, whilst its chthonic residents look on in awe of him. <laughs> He's not really that great. <laughs> Down. <laughs> I like this. Um, that's cute, dude. Yeah, it is. Um, yeah. Okay, so you think so too. Okay, then it's not just me thinking that it's the same voice actor. Well, okay. We could give uh, the nectar to Hades, but I don't think I want to do that. You're my father, not my friend. And it says I should give it to a friend. Um... While I would like to give it to Cerberus, I think I'll give it to Nyx, since Nyx seems like she has helped us before. So let's kind of show that we are grateful for that. Um, Nyx, you've done so much for me. I thought you might like this. A gift as beautiful as this requires reciprocity, dear child. I wish, regardless, to provide you a token of my love. Okay. I'm very grateful, Nick. New keepsake, black shawl. Not sure what that does, but it looked like our health maybe was boosted. Um, okay, there's a locked door here. Not sure what that's about. I wonder if we've seen everything else there is to see here uh, that is to see here <laughs> not there is <laughs> um, okay I guess that means we should go on another run then wait what's this here hmm, looks like a garden but we can't enter and that's a grumpy ghost okay I guess it's time for the next run <laughs> hey room I'm back Oh, use the mirror to grow stronger. Seems like this is our uh, our room, our bed chamber, <laughs> and we can check out more stuff. The What's bed this? Chambers of Prince Zagreus lie in a perpetual state of utter disarray, <laughs> despite his lord and master of the house repeatedly insisting <laughs> that he pick everything up. Ah, uh, that's funny. I can relate. <laughs> oh, come on, it's not that bad. Is it? <laughs> uh, 
Ah, uh, that's nice. Um, and it also just fits with um, Greek mytholo mythology in general because basically it's just um, human life and human shenanigans uh, thrown on the sky. That's what my philosophy teacher used to say at least and I think it makes sense. Like it's um, betrayal and fights between gods but still they act so mortal in in their ways <laughs> and um yeah let's reflect a bit night and darkness guide me okay so this is how we can boost our stats so we need the darkness mirror of night within the infinite dark everything okay Shadow Presence, each rank makes you deal plus 10% damage when you strike foes from behind. Uh, Chthonic vi Vitality, each rank restores one heart when you enter each chamber. Okay. Death Defiance, each rank restores you to 50% health one time when your life total is depleted. Okay, that will be helpful. Greater Reflex, you can perform plus one additional something okay additional dash in quick succession that will be useful as well but for now i guess let's boost our vitality maybe and we can unlock something as soon as we get more keys okay it's starting to make sense so let's boost vitality for now since we can and don't have enough for anything else Okay, yep, it is. Um, what does resting do? I wonder. This looks... Well, we'll find out next time, I guess. <laughs> okay. Or we can go back. Okay, we can go back. My so I... Back the other way. Okay. I'm wide awake. Okay, I guess there is no rest. <laughs> no rest for the wicked. So through that pink window there. Okay, even more stuff to discover. So we can unlock new ve weapons Don't here, I think. Keys. So we could unlock a bow already. Not sure if I want that. These weapons look more interesting to me right now, so I think I'm gonna save my two keys for now and save them to get something. Uh, black shawl deal plus 10 percent damage striking undamaged foes also striking foes from behind nice let's take it all set no uh, i wish you could see it on the character but yeah you can't that's a shame would be cool just cosmetic but still cool let's get past the retro shades of tartarus okay easier said than done and doubtless I'll be running into Meg. The River of Flame ought to be just beyond. Find a way up to Elysium from there, and after that... All right, let's give it another <laughs> shot. Okay, that's really cool. They've really set this up great. I mean, like, showing us basically what we have to go through, and yeah, all this is really, really well done. <laughs> I... I really love this so far. So let's escape. Uh, yeah, this game runs really well, actually. Uh, what's that? Is this really him? Okay. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Zeus. Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather different, and he's not so much as called in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing. Thanks. Your attack emits chain lightning when you damage a foe. Electric shot, your cast is a burst of chain lightning that bounces between foes. That sounds pretty cool. Your dash causes a lightning bolt to strike foes. Um, 
I would like to to test this, but I'm not sure if it will help me as much as the as the lightning strike. I think for now I will stick to melee attacks. Ah, sorry, you said I, I should. You said I should select the second one. Okay, well, sorry that I didn't, but next time. <laughs> Okay, well, yeah, I think for now it's better for me to stick with the melee attacks. Um, I mean, this is basically the ranged attack, the regular one. You can only throw this thing and then you have to pick it up again. Um, so I, I will try to use that more often. And what's this? I haven't checked this out. Okay. Good thing I'm not dead. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. You asked uh, if this game was running good on my PC. Yeah. And even though I don't have the greatest graphics card, I can play this game with a really good frame rate, even on 4K. So um, this seems to be not requiring too much in regards to um, processing power. Uh, sadly, I can't record in 4k at the same time that's too much for my pc i actually tried that would have been really cool but sadly it's not it's not possible um. yeah as i said i'll try to utilize the ranged attack as well this time to kind of get the hang of it um and hopefully then when the next time I get offered such an upgrade, I will feel comfortable selecting uh, the ranged boost. I'm not sure what these mean. I think this is boosting my max health. So maybe that's a good choice. Yeah, 1080p definitely looks well enough um, in general, but I mean, if you have a 4K monitor, it feels really nice to actually be able to play a game in 4K as well. <laughs> so since I do have one, uh, that's pretty cool that I can actually play this one in 4K. I mean, it's looking even crisper then, and that's really cool. So, um, I guess let's get another key. This will be darkness. We can boost our abilities with this and this will be like a key to unlock new weapons and stuff. I guess it will be interesting to try new weapons and we can always boost our stats later. We are really dealing a lot of damage here, I think. <laughs> At least, I mean, we are not fighting the big enemies here, but even these didn't fall that quickly the last time. Oh, damn. Got hit there by a projectile. That's all right for now. Okay. There we get our key. Okay, so I think these will be coins. Uh, like we see in the lower right corner, we have coins and keys. I think I and I've seen this when I first tried this game this will upgrade one of our abilities I think so I think I will go directly for the upgrade and not try to get coins that I might or might not be able to spend later so okay so these are actually that that creatures Damn, and I'm threatening to kill them again. I mean, it makes sense. Um, everything that is not a god or a half god is probably dead down here, and I'm not doing well right now. I think I walked into that trap as well. Okay, at least I got a trap kill. A palm of power. Okay, lightning strike boosted. That's nice. Mm. 
I know man I kind of want to get a 1080p 144 hertz because 4k 144 hertz is really expensive yeah right and you'd need uh, uh, yeah a monster of a computer to actually get to that resolution and frame rate uh, will be really hard to achieve and maybe in some games even impossible to achieve what are these haven't seen these before I think I don't know but they are gone so I guess that's fine um, yeah I don't have a higher refresh rate monitor sadly um, when I bought this one I was also thinking about watching movies in 4k but then I got a 4k TV anyway so that was kind of redundant so actually I wish right now I would have rather gotten a 1080p and a high refresh rate monitor would have made more sense for playing games but yeah whatever uh, this is still a nice nice piece of hardware <laughs> I'm not gonna replace it anytime soon and I've barely made it out of that trap area damn well, I think I liked Athena's boost a bit more since I had the ability to deflect projectiles and all that and now I can only dodge them and I like the deflection a bit more. <laughs> Even if this uh, chain lightning is quite nice, I prefer the deflection ability. No way to patch up. Got to keep going. Yeah, I mean, since I boosted my max health, I'm still fine, relatively. I mean, I'm still at a higher uh, total health than I was at the beginning of the run, so as long as that's the case, I'm not gonna complain, but the enemies will deal more damage too, obviously, so that's not great. But it's good that they are so close to each other. The chain lightning is really helping here. And I got hit again. All right. We got hit once, but that's all right. And we got some darkness. Um, I think this might actually be a shop. I'm not sure though. And I'm not sure what this is. I don't know if we have enough gold to buy useful stuff. So let's pick this, whatever it is. Looks like Poseidon's trident. But I guess we'll see. I mean, I hope we will. If we survive this, we will. But I'm getting hit a bit often here. Ah, these are traps. I didn't recognize that. That's useful to know. Uh, I hope I can still survive this. Damn. Well, barely alive. <laughs> Crashing waves a trident, yeah. It's got to be. Then in the name of Hades, Olympus may accept this message. Okay. Hoy there, little Hades. You recognize your uncle, do you not? We've a lot of catching up to do, but first things first. You get yourself out of that tower on the world. <laughs> For me, I'll see if I can stir things up a bit to cover your advance. Okay. What what have you got? Floodshot, your cast damages foes in an area and knocks them away. Totally forgot about the cast again. Tidal dash, your dash damages foes in an area and knocks them away. He, hydraulic might, your attack and special are stronger for 5 seconds in encounters. Initial bonus damage plus 130%. Um, I think I like the dash. <laughs> so having the dash knocking away enemies seems really cool and having the dash deal 35 damage is quite a lot. So I think I'll pick that one. Um, 
Yeah, okay. I just read the chat and uh, read what you wrote. Yeah, that that makes sense. I mean, uh, focusing on uh, the refresh rate seems reasonable for playing games, especially if you're into playing competitive games, which I am not that much, so it might also still make sense for me to play rather at a higher resolution than a higher refresh rate, but yeah, not sure. Uh, I'm happy with what I've got. Not sure if I'd make the same decision again, but it's fine. This might actually be another god helping us, so I think I pick this path. Not sure if it is, but we'll find out. Um, oh, I, we probably won't find out since I'm at 6 health. <laughs> but at least we can try Poseidon's boost a bit. There's no escape. <laughs> yeah, still, this was interesting. Mm -hmm. Here we are again. What have you got for me? Oh, you just got killed by one of those bloodless inferno bomber skeleton type guys. Nice. <laughs> I always wondered what would happen if you just kind of stood around while all their bombs went off. Mm hmm. Okay. I hate you. <laughs> so at the desk next to the throne. I mean, I don't really. It's a cool character, but. Yeah. <laughs> Rub it in. Who's this? Renovate. Sounds interesting. There's still so much to discover here. Keep What's happening here? I've known great men throughout my life, and I can always tell when someone's better than their circumstances. Fight like I fight out there. Okay. I'll give them hell as you once did, Achilles. Though doubtless many of the shades who stand against me first arrived in Tartarus because of you. <laughs> I guess let's renovate. Some sort of special offer for me, my good shade. Uh, fountain chamber Tartarus restores some health amid the gloom. Okay. Uh, grand opening deal. The house contractor is offering this particular renovation free of charge. At a chamber, an otherwise inaccessible location to be found in the ever-shifting underworld. Life, your life total, lose it all for an express trip back to the House of Hades. I like these tiny floating ball face thingies in the corners. Yeah, I guess if it's free, we'll take it. Work authorized. A fountain chamber in the depths of Tartarus sounds like an excellent idea. Okay. Um, we seem to not have any jewels, so we can't buy any of these, but that's all right. What have we unlocked? Was it the closed door up here or? Nope, it wasn't. I'm curious. Okay, we can have something new here. Maybe it will only unlock after we leave. Or is there a fountain somewhere here now? Hmm. I don't see anything, but maybe it's also in the next room. Let's talk to Hades. Who's that sniveling shade your immediate left there, father? <laughs> Already found someone new to do the busy work. And here I thought I was utterly indispensable. That shade boy is my newly designated contractor. One whose responsibility is to work on this house. Though who shall pay for everything my subjects here demand, I do not know. <laughs> You're trying to guilt me into funding the exorbitant furnishings you desire. Yeah. <laughs> Perhaps once we are finished with repairs for all the carnage you have sown throughout my realm, then we might finally have time for all the needed renovations that have piled up. Nice. I like the dynamic they have going there. <laughs> Shades, we've kept you waiting long enough. Ah, okay, so they are like petitioners. <laughs> uh, 
That's really cool. What? <laughs> well, then. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, this is nice. It's so cool that they added all these Go tiny ahead. details. <laughs> Go ahead. I just watched these for a I while. See. Pop denied. <laughs> Now I'm curious, now I need to keep watching. Quickly. And you did what? <laughs> Denied. <laughs> I love it. I'm sure he won't accept anything, but if he would, it would be interesting. Wow, there are so many to come. Hey, I suppose it will be on repeat at some point. Denied. <laughs> Obviously. Okay, one more. Well, next. Make it quick. Hmm. We might have heard this one. Is that so? I guess we have. How you holding up, boy? Eating well lately? All three mouths full and happy? <laughs> Each terrifying maw of the infernal watchdog Cerberus responds affirmatively, one to the next, <laughs> as if to reassure the ever doubting prince. <laughs> All right. Here, boy. Just as long as one of your three heads enjoys these pets. No, denied. <laughs> Next. Okay, just gonna check real quick. Get to the point. Hmm, I think we haven't heard that. Or did? Oh no, we haven't seen that emoji either. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Amazing! Next, you. Finally, got someone got their Quickly. wish granted. <laughs> Truly. These emojis are great. <laughs> Categorically denied. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is so nice. And the voice acting is so on point as well. Categorically denied. With it. So? This reminds me of playing Yes, Your Grace. <laughs> Claim denied. Okay, I'll go on the next run Don't now. Guide you, child. You have outgrown this house. Of that I am now certain. Should you return again here, I shall keep you safe. Okay. I won't forget you, Nix, I swear it. What's this? What once was a small lounging area within the House of Hades now is sealed off in utter shambles since the multi-headed Cerberus tore the space apart, mourning the missing prince. I'm not missing. Cerberus destroyed the lounge again. I was just trying to escape. So? Relax. Not as comfy as it looks. Okay. Absurd. Denied. Ah, <laughs> uh, I love it. I could listen to that all day long, but I suppose it might be boring for some who watch. So I am gonna continue. Okay, Death Defiance. That sounds pretty neat. Let's get it. Okay, the next one will be a lot more expensive. Um, well, there's still no rest for us and I guess we continue to the next room and unlock a weapon. So maybe let's get the shield.
might be useful. There we go. Aegis, shield of chaos. Lend me your power. What the... scary servant planet there. Okay. Ooh, who's that? Bash, defend, throw. While dashing to dash strike. That seems pretty neat. Who are you? Nice place you got here, boyo. Name Skelly has it going, but enough with the smart talk already. I'm here to do a job. <laughs> so let me have it. Give me everything you got. Okay. I don't remember having you on payroll, mate. Who's your supervisor? Oh, I'm not about to wrap my sources, pal. Just try and beat it out of me. <laughs> okay. If you insist. Yeah, nice. This is cool. I like it. Um I could hit harder than that. All right. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Bet I got you pretty good. Okay. This is interesting. Let's see, is there anything new here? The path toward the surface lies somewhere beyond all that. Okay, not really. We are still at eleven chambers. Alright, so let's give our shield a go. Ready. Let's see what kind of boost we get at the beginning here. That looks like a Daedalus hammer. Ooh. Enchantments for my weapon. Mm-hmm. Minotaur rush, your bull rush gains a power rush that deals plus 500 damage whoa percent damage uh, okay power rush hold x then release when you see a brief flash for a stronger tackle okay interesting explosive return your special deals 50 damage to foes around you when you catch it okay sudden rush your bull rush charges up faster I think I'm gonna try this. This this sounds uh, like it's giving more options to the gameplay, so I might fail it. Wherever you may be right now, thank you. Might fail using it, but I guess we'll see. Well, that worked. Out. I think I need to charge it pretty far until I'm flashing. Yeah, that was the flash there. I think when it's just fully charged and when I let go in that uh, on on that in that precise moment, then it deals those 500% bonus damage. Whoa! Um, just walked into that trap. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Um Look what I found. Okay. Didn't take any more damage, so that's fine. Okay, let's get uh the Zeus upgrade again. Okay. Faith and courage, Zacrius. For each and every one of us upon Olympus is behind you all the way throughout this whole affair. That's nice. 
Uh, do we have the same ones as the first time? Your special causes a lightning bolt to strike nearby foes? I don't think we do. Your cast is a burst of chain lightning that bounces between foes. Thunder dash, your dash causes a lightning bolt to strike nearby foes. Well, boosting our dash some more seems nice, but yeah, I, th I said I would try the, the electric shot, so let's do it. All right, Lord Zeus. Okay. Let's proceed and get some more of that nectar to give to our friends. <laughs> Yeah, okay, it will make sense when I use it against more enemies, I assume. Other than that, it's a bit underwhelming right now. Okay, that worked well. Sweet. Yeah, so the nectar won't help us with our run, but <laughs> at least we have something to boost us for the next one. What are these things? Haven't seen them before. There's a lot of traps around here. I like shields. Okay. I'll take it. Let's take some coin. Um, is there only one path out of here? I think there is. So let's take it. Whoops, I think I got hit by that trap, but I'm not quite sure. If I did, I didn't lose much health, so that's nice. Uh, well, this has a weird sign on it. Maybe it means... Ah, okay, it means there are really strong enemies, I think. But that's all right. Maybe we get a really nice reward as well. So let's go. Ah, these again. Ah, damn. Once again that dodge and like those bomb drops where they then run away and the bombs immediately explode. I'm not sure how to dodge that definitely too quick for me. I think smashing the enemy into the wall makes them pretty much unable to react anymore. So that's nice. Um, okay, I can give a gift here. That is interesting. Uh, I think I'll just accept for now. Alright. <laughs> Drunken strike, your attacks uh, attack inflicts hangover. Drunken flourish, your special inflicts hangover. Positive outlook. <clears throat> you take less damage while at 40% health or below. Huh. I think this might help me the most because it prevents me from dying. So I guess I'll take this one. Cheers to that. 
and we continue for more darkness. Damn, stupid trap. Well, that's a risk while using the shield and bashing around a lot because um, you might bash straight into a trap. <laughs> Okay, could have gone worse, so it's all right. Okay, where do we go? We could go shopping, um, but we could also boost one of our abilities. Hmm. Now ah, we haven't been to the shop yet, so let's go. I think I hear the river. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Why, well, good to see you, Caron, mate. Just minding my own business, taking in the sights, and hey, what's that? You got some sort of wares for sale? Then I'll just have a look around. Okay. <laughs> we can give the nectar to Caron. I mean, why not? Been such a reassuring sight, I thought I'd offer you a token of my gratitude. <laughs> I think he's happy. Wait, you don't have to give me something in return. It was a gift. Though you're insisting, aren't you? <laughs> I don't know what to say, mate. Bone hourglass. Interesting. The infernal wares of the Stygian boatman Caron lie sprawled about. Available for sale to whomever would be willing to quench the boatman's great thirst for riches. Okay. <laughs> exactly. Um. Hmm. Regain some health. That seems useful. I mean, we could boost our health and regain some health, but then we won't get this. I think this might boost our abilities. Huh. Tough decision. I guess I'm gonna go with health here. I'll pay for that. Yeah. Okay, full health and boosted at that, so that's nice. Let's continue. Timing there. Yeah, that wasn't great. Um, and I try to use my ranged attack more often, but that thing lay around here, so I couldn't. I think that made things worse for me. Okay, we can boost our health even more here, which is nice. Numbskulls. Whoa. That was nice. Exactly the right, the right type of enemy for this uh, chain lightning attack. Nice. <laughs> yeah, okay, I see the appeal now of that attack. Who's throwing these? Ah, okay. Well, this didn't start out great, but it turned out all right. Um, darkness or key? I think let's go for darkness. Don't think I've gone this far. Yeah, 
new territories. <laughs> Damn, and new ways to fail. Damn. I think we could go shopping again, but we don't have many coins. Uh, okay, I think we can't do anything else. So I guess the shop it is. Okay, this looks different. Beyond the present chamber lies the outermost perimeter of Tartarus, promising terrifying dangers far beyond the underworld prince's reckoning. Hmm? And I can reckon quite a bit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I really like the humor in this game. Um, well, at least we can regain some health. That's quite useful. Hey again. All right. Guess I'm gonna head into the boss fight now. <laughs> Wish me luck. This is awkward. <laughs> it is. Not one step further. Megara, first of the Furies. This game also makes me really want to read up on more Greek mythology. <laughs> because, yeah, all these characters are quite interesting and I wonder what their historic background is in, in some cases. Like this one-winged Fury, I guess. It's interesting. Come on, Meg. Haven't we had more than enough of each other by now? Besides, don't you have someplace else to be? Your father sent me. All in all, I'd rather be on your bad side than his. Are okay. You turn back like a good little man, or I can send you home the painful way. What'll it be? I guess the painful way. <laughs> I'll have to go with the painful way. Yep. <laughs> A man after my own heart. Aww. <laughs> oh damn. Whoa. Okay, I think I have to play with a bit more tactics here. Or just with shield bashes. Seems to be working well so far. Especially if I get that flash down. Whoa, bullet hell! Whoa! <laughs> this is intense. Whoa, trap. Damn, no! No, stop that! Wow, this is intense. Timed it right for once. Stop it! Stop chasing me! <laughs> Hear me on my authority. Oh, damn. This is 
a long fight. <laughs> This is really intense. <laughs> that okay I was was I revived I don't know oh no I've activated that damage limiting thing because I'm low low on health now <laughs> Death defied, I'm still alive here. No. Whoa. <laughs> that was intense. Uh, I think I just got impatient in the end, otherwise I might have been able to do better. But whatever, I did it. <laughs> First try! Bounty claim, Titan blood. Oh, what I wouldn't give for, say, a healing flask of some sort. <laughs> yep, would be nice. <laughs> Thanks, this was an intense fight. <laughs> and a lot of fun, I can tell you. This was really, really cool. Like... Uh, I mean, it, it didn't feel unfair or anything. It felt like you just got to figure out the pattern and then you can do this. Uh, yeah, this this was nice. <laughs> <sighs> Let me catch my breath here. <laughs> Heart is beating relatively fast. I'm a bit shaky, but that's a good thing. <laughs> so let's proceed. How did you? <laughs> Hades is not happy. Ooh, fountains. Okay. I guess let's restore health then. Okay, what's going on here? We can sell stuff and we can shop. Okay. What can we buy? Price of Midas. Uh, gain... 39 gold for a blood price. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I can't buy these, so whatever. I don't think I want to exchange my health for gold. That's not how I roll. What can I sell? Huh. Uh, I don't think I want to get rid of these. This has been really helpful against groups of enemies. So... I guess we're done here and let's see what awaits us. Yes. <laughs> I like the shift in the art style. Okay. Asphodel. Interesting. Um, okay. Don't don't go out of bounds here. I got it. <laughs> um. Hmm. It's nice and warm out here. I'll give it that. 
Okay, no more commentary. That's alright. I guess, um... We embark. <laughs> Okay, we can still smash stuff. Whoa! Damn! Well, that changes things that you can always fall off the edge. doing well here but well, that's all right need to learn the ropes here first okay the enemies get damaged by the lava too that's fair okay did it somehow um, I guess I'll take the positive outlook although this deals a lot more damage if I upgrade it uh, uh, whatever, I want more protection. Okay. Where to? Hmm. Keys or darkness? Ah, I boost my darkness. Course is set will be interesting to try the other weapons, but for now I'm happy with the shield. waves are hard to dodge. Damn again. You're dead. I think they know that they are dead. Are these the actual enemies or I think they are? Mark Mark Hill. Still alive. That's good. So what's next? Shop or increase max health? I think I'll go for an increase of our max health. Because that basically heals us as well. So that's nice. If we can survive this. Might have... Might have done good to consider that first, but okay, here we are. <laughs> Damn, stepped in the magma. Ah, again. Okay, almost dead here. I don't think we'll survive this, sadly. Ooh, whoa, yeah, there's no escape, I know. <laughs> oh, surprise. <laughs> 
Here I am again in the house of Hades. Thanks. It's usually pretty quiet keeping watch over the pool of sticks back there, but it's sure been busy lately. Why, somebody else came through just earlier. You should have seen the look on my face when it wasn't you. Okay. Glad to keep things interesting. What have you got to say, Achilles? A relic of some sort out there. A globule of ancient blood which formed after I fought with Megara. Is this really the Titan's blood I found? As far as I know, yes, lad. That it is. Though who's exactly, I'm not so sure. You'd best hang on to it and keep it safe. Your weapons. They shall thirst for it and drink it up. Not yet, perhaps, but soon. Okay. So, upgrade our weapons, I assume. Well, I wasn't about to drink it. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, thanks for joining. I think I'm going to quit here relatively soon as well. Um, but yeah, once again, thank you for joining and sleep well. And thanks for staying so long. I appreciate that and I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> okay. So what else is there to explore? Uh, well, we can talk to Cerberus again. Don't let him sour up everyone's mood. Cerberus promises to do exactly that. Thanks, narrator. Uh, and obviously, we whoops, pet Cerberus again. <laughs> oh. Okay. Father, what happened to the lounge? The only place for anyone to have a little fun around here, and you seal it shut. Oh, I had little choice about that boy. You see, after you fled the first time, Cerberus, why, he was very much upset. Utterly tore the place to shreds. It's now under repair. All thanks to you. Yeah, sure. Blame me. You're really blaming me for not minding the dog while I was <laughs> and while you all were here. <laughs> Fair point. Upon you, yes. Who else? It's fortunate that Cerberus has calmed himself since then. Come to his senses, I should say. May you yet come to yours. Yeah. You can wait long for that. I don't think. There, I must say. Yeah, I don't think I got any of these jewels, so nothing to do there. <laughs> More petitioners coming in. What is it? Indeed. Denied. <laughs> okay. You must have vanquished Megara, my child. For she has been sulking in the corner ah. for quite some time. You are safe here from her whip, but not her words. <laughs> That's all right. I'd better talk to her. Thank you for the heads up, Nix. See you later, I'm sure. Hey there. The prodigal son returns. Everyone's saying I went easy on you, Zag. You didn't. That was a really hard fight. <laughs> Don't worry, Meg. I eventually managed to get home the painful way after all. <laughs> Look, I have a reputation to uphold. If you get past me again like that, you best go all the way. Now leave me be and don't think you're going to be so lucky next we meet out there. Okay. Huh. What brings you here? Not really sure. Ah, okay, you're not talking to me. That's all right. Um, okay, I'm gonna quickly check out what I can upgrade, but I think after that I'm gonna call it a night and finish uh, things here for now. Darkness is power. Yeah, seems so. Greater reflex. You can perform plus one additional right trigger dash in quick succession. That sounds useful. I'm gonna get it. And it's maxed out. Okay. So you can max it to the two dashes. 
Uh, that's all right. We have the Shadow Presence, um, giving us bonus damage when we strike enemies from behind, or we could um, increase our Catonic Vitality. I think that's more essential, so let's pick it. Um, and okay, we seem to have five keys. That's nice. Uh, oh no, we need five keys. We only have, I don't know, it doesn't show. Um, but we'll see that in the next room. Okay. Hey. You know something, Boyo? I think you could do a real number on one of these columns holding up this place and bring the whole thing down in just a few swipes. Boom, boom, boom. And hate to be standing near one of them if you did. Okay. Wreck my father's finely crafted architecture every chance I get. <laughs> I can do for sure. <laughs> Yeah, I I already did. So he's giving us hints on uh, how to fight, and uh, yeah, you can uh, smack the columns, and then stones will fall down, and they hurt the enemies around you. Got something new uh, to try. Okay, so uh, I don't know what encounters are, but probably boss fights. I don't know. Um, and this gives us uh, bonus damage against undamaged foes and when striking from behind and this items from the well of Charon have durations increased by plus four encounters okay I think I'll keep the shawl for now I don't know maybe encounters are just uh, regular rooms basically because uh, this seems to be like there's this progression bar on the bottom and it seems to be almost maxed out. So this seems to have been a lot more at some point, maybe also 25 or even 50 or something like that. Don't quite remember. But yeah, we will soon upgrade this. So that's nice. I think for the next run, I'll probably use the sword again, just to... You're using that thing now, huh? Yep. <laughs> Um, just to keep things interesting, change things up a bit. But I'm not going to do this today, but um, in the next stream and or video on YouTube, since I'm also recording this and or live streaming this wherever you are seeing this. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this so far. I definitely did. This is really, really well done. Like. Um, the art style is really cool, um, the story they are telling is really interesting and especially the characters and uh, I mean the characters are obviously taken from Greek mythology but the way they depict these characters and write the interactions based on their characters that's really really cool and the humor in it is really nice as well. And obviously the gameplay is a lot of fun, really challenging in that boss fight especially. Um, and yeah, really intriguing. So um, I am really curious on uh, what's yet to come. So I'll definitely live stream this again and record a video at the same time for YouTube. So yeah, as I said, hope you enjoyed this. If you did, um, Please subscribe to my channel on YouTube. Please follow me on Twitter and also Twitch if you like. We can get in, in, in touch there and uh, I'll keep you updated. Like every time I post a new video on, um, on YouTube, I also post that on uh, Twitter and we can also start conversations about different things if we feel like it. So yeah, would be cool if you would head over there and um, I guess that's all. If you enjoyed this, please leave a, a thumbs up and I hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care and um, bye for now. <laughs>